How goes the family? Welcome back to Larry's Anything Goes. Hopefully you guys are having a great day. Today's poem is going to be called Were You Guys Financially Prepared for COVID-19? Poem. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. And obviously, hopefully you guys are being safe out there with yourself and your loved ones and your friends practicing the good old social distancing. Here we go. None of us, for the most part, right from the start, were truly prepared, even those of us who dared to save up our dollars and cents, to those of us who bought assets and took all of the hints that were put out there into the world and the galaxy. It has to be crazy for the paycheck-to-paycheck -paycheck circle and to the world. It's our new reality. The practicality of the financially literate is to work hard, invest hard, save hard so that we can still drop those gifts. This channel isn't just about purchasing assets and getting a nice whiff of financial fresh air. It's about securing yourselves financially so when the economy in itself crumbles and tears down because we live in an economy that's called boom and bust. There's unfortunately lots of people out there who are suffering from the COVID-19 illness and who could have foresaw the world shutting down? to the point where no one wants to go out or to be one another around. It's crazy. Life has turned into like being a cage at a dog pound. At one another, we need to stop throwing negative verbal lightning bolts. We all need to support one another and gather for the great true collective revolt. The revolt of saving money, the revolt of investing money, the revolt of teaming up our money, because one thing that isn't really funny is that there's... 6.6 .6 million people out there whose days aren't looking too sunny. We should spend less time on, on people trying to hate. We should spend more time trying to celebrate. Let's celebrate being alive, talk about and implement trying to liberate ourselves from being beholden to the just over broke J-O-B categories. We all know for the most of the population how the end of this story doesn't end in glory. It ends with people being placed in a financial trap laboratory. So many are victims of the comfort zone sickness that when the chickens come home to roost, we have to go to other sources so that we can try to maintain and to not boost. Now, with all of this free time on our hands, lots of people are just going to let loose and not come out of this craziness on top. The having a safe job bubble has finally been popped because everyone's life has been dropped down to a level that no one could have ever thought. Those that were caught in the middle of the nonsense, now people feel like they are going through a physical financial assault. People are getting drove over like a speed bump, and economically, we are scared to take a leap or just some sort of jump. People are so comfortable with being occupied by entertainment and being economic chumps. We are living in a time where it's time to put brakes on our outrageous spending habits. Let's call it a pump. People are getting chills because they can't pay their employees and they cannot pay their bills. This is not and never will be a laughing matter. Like when one's losing control of their bladder. The 2020 roads are not paved. So right now, if you don't need, save, save, and just save. I have nothing but love and respect. I just want to thank all of those employees that are essential. Doctors, nurses, truck drivers, retail, grocery store workers, garbage collectors, like always, keeping us afloat with your hard work and potential. If you're making overtime money, then please, please save it all and invest a little until we get back to the central point of that appears normal and at a reasonable function. Right now, it's obvious that we are at a point of financial injunction. The way of only making money via earned income is starting to become an ancient determination because society has done a great job to that imposing closing down business sanctions. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's poem. Please give it a like, thumbs up, check out the online store. If you want to become a business partner with me and my people, Check out the Care Bars International Family so you can start making currency and run all in your circle, especially with these crazy dark days that we are in and that we're he possibly heading towards. Continuously make your money moves. If not with Care Bars, and do it with something else, obviously. But hey, it's all about making money with your folks, not just being a part of a sports team league and, and all that fantasy football stuff. Have your own fantasy financial reality so that you can make money in your sleep and make money while you're working for somebody else. All right, family, take care, practice your social, your social distancing and be safe. All right.